men just thought it was a joke, women playing guitar and playing drums, you know, it had never been done before. So they were forced to band together, form bands together. What do you think is the reason it happened at the same time as punk came up? Um, it was it was because the whole thing about punk was you just got up on the, on the stage and did whatever you wanted to do, and you didn't have to be professional about it. It started around 76, really, I think, with the Slits. They were about the first all-women band. They were very much like the Sex Pistols in the beginning. And it was punk that brought them out with this idea of getting up on the stage and just just playing, just making a noise and not having to be particularly professional about it. <laughs> We're just four people, mm. we're not two men and two women. When we work together, it's personalities that count, mm. it's count individual characters. When you sit down and write a song, you don't think, oh, I'm a woman, I'll write something about women. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't affect women, I mean, women, being women doesn't affect music at all. It's, no, it's irrelevant. It doesn't make any we're just, difference We're just a band, just because we happen to be girls. So, you know, it doesn't make that much difference, we don't think, anyway. Ja, Kann wichtig würde ich sagen, ist es insofern, all die Wahl, ähm, dass die Musik überhaupt bestimmt. Und zwar bestimmt die Art und Weise, wie wir miteinander umgehen, wie wir miteinander spielen. We are fucking women making music. You know, that is, that's all there is to say about it. It's obvious, you know. The rhythms are obvious. It's, it's all there. They don't want to be classed as a separate category to male musicians. They just want to be classed as musicians, which is what they are. And doing a programme or an interview with women in band and calling it women in rock is categorising them, separating them. But it's also because um, it's stereotype. a lot of them think they're going to be stereotyped as feminists and as anti-men, and they're not anti-men either. They want to be treated as equals. I don't to do it. I'm very stolz drauf. But we take, try to take our whole personality, you know, with all its faults onto the stage, right. our clothes. So then you can say in the, in the same breath, it's not entertainment, right? No. It's not entertainment. Because when you entertain, you go out there and you, you, you make bullshit. it up. You entertain, you bullshit, you fake the way you feel, you, you present it. Even if you think, oh, this is, a, this is crap, you make it look good so the audience have paid their money. And so We don't do that. It's not entertainment. Because to me... To me, to define entertainment anyway, is if you entertain someone, then you stimulate something from within them. So if we can go out there and stimulate some kind of interest in, the, in these people, whether it's from our dancing, what we wear, what we say, how, what we play, the atmosphere we create, the mistakes we make, if they can just pick up on one, one of those things and use it, you know, and find it funny or silly or what, you know, or entertaining, then that's good, you know, we feel like we've done something. But we're not out there to just give them a picture which they can just stare at and be zombied out on, like mesmerised, you know. Somewhere we've got to either annoy them or excite them or make them laugh or something, you know.
about I mean it's just definitely just a paper thing you know they they talk about it the way they used to talk about beetle haircuts or something like big trends no the new thing we're now writing about is women in music and it's the same carry on yeah, it's the same as it's like it's divisionary <laughs> <laughs> silly girl aus aber alles ist wichtig and I can't sit there and cry and say, but it, it's, it's, we come from one earth, you know, we're earthlings. And it, that's exactly what we're fighting all the time, is people's brains, that their narrow-minded brains, that they want something to cling on to, like... It doesn't matter how he comes from Germany, you know, she's your sister whether she comes from Germany or Japan, so be interested because she's interesting. Cool. <laughs> 